Hey, everybody, good evening. Oh, this is going to be a pretty chill stream. I'm just going to be working through the Pokedex. Um, I think at this point, I'm just going to need to go one by one and track down each thing. Because uh, doing it randomly in the wild area was not not super productive yesterday. But we'll get into it. Um, thank you to everybody who followed on the last stream. I really appreciate it. Welcome to anybody who's watching now, and welcome to anybody who's watching in the past broadcasts or any other archive thing like I have on YouTube. Come hang out live sometime. You know, I have the schedule on the stream and everything, and I tweet whenever I go live, so I'd love to chat with y'all live sometime. All that being said, let's get into this. Yeah, we're at the point, well, I'm at the point uh, now where, ooh, oh, I do not have one of you, I believe. Um, I'm at the point now where I just have the Champion Cup left, and then I mean the DLC and stuff, but that's, we're going to wait until we have the, the main decks filled out to do that. In the meantime, let me see. Let me see what's up with this. Uh, this looks like a rock type, maybe? Let's let's hit him with Psychic, see how that works out. Yeah, I... I'm trying to decide if I want to actually, like, grind out the rest of the Pokedex before I do the Champion's Cup, or do the Champion's Cup, and then... Um... Uh, and then grind out the rest of it after. So if I do do the Champions Cup, I'd be working on that next Saturday. Um, for now, this is just going to be filling some stuff in. Filling in any of the holes in the Pokedex. I'm like a third of the way through the Pokedex. I'm hoping to get past the halfway point by the end of today's stream. Uh, maybe up to 200? No. No, that's too much. I got like 80 to go, so that's 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 wishful thinking. Although, nice, I got it. Sorry, distracted a little bit. Um, yeah, maybe. Who knows? I I'm definitely gonna be going back to earlier areas and some very low level Pokemon. So, we'll see how it works out. Mm. Gorlux data will be added to the Pokedex. Gorlux, the automaton Pokemon. There's a theory that inside Gorluck is a perpetual motion machine that produces limitless energy, but this belief hasn't been proven. Yeah. Call him... Let's call him Storkules. I've been watching a lot of uh, DuckTales 2017. Uh, not as much. I mean, we caught up, so... I'd like to watch more, but nothing until next year. Tears. It's a really good show if you haven't watched it. Um... Like, really, really good. Well, there goes the game audio. That's fine. I'm going to need to take a minute. But... <sighs> so used to hitting start to open a menu, but it's it's X. <laughs> uh, so let's check the Pokedex and see see what I need to get still. We're, we're at 129, and there's like 370-something? Let me just bust all the way down to the bottom to check. Um, I've seen a good chunk, but most of them have been in trainer battles. I find if you just, like, do all of the trainer battles along the way, you're just so OP for the gyms and everything. And I'm going to wait to reset the Elgato so that you don't have to hear the clicking as that all goes down. Oh, 395. Okay, so closer to, like... Wow, yeah, closer to, like, uh... 400, but I am at about the third third point here. I'm like too shy, I think. Math, I don't know. I'm an actor. I don't need to know the, the STEM stuff. It is fun, though, so, you know. All right, uh, these are all going to be the starters, so not much I can do right now. Blipbug Dotler. Oh, yeah, we run into a bunch of those early on um okay let me see does it say where it might be hanging out no 
Oh, wait, habitat. Yes, X. There we go. Yes, that's what I wanted to know. Okay. So I'm going to go through and get all of the ones that I haven't gotten yet um, that I've seen. And then I'll swing back around and start getting all the ones that I don't have anything of. So I'm going to head to turf field. And while it's doing that, I'm going to reset the Elgato. I need, I need to get this uh, HD 60s plus <laughs> that's pretty much it because like this one just can't can't handle it with Mac although and again wishful thinking I entered into this like Microsoft sweepstakes for an Alienware computer and it doesn't it most times you'd be like eh, that doesn't mean anything in this case I've been using Bing since high school so I had like 30,000 points so I entered 700 times so, uh, pretty good odds. Fingers crossed, you know, knock on wood. Um, maybe, maybe it'd be very good for the stream because it, it will have a much better video card. The MacBook video card's fine, but it's just, you need a pretty hardcore one for a game like this. And now I believe this is the correct direction. Hold on, actually, I'm gonna move move Mr. Burns up top because Mr. Burns has Spore and Spore is going to be really good. I should also do some fishing. I, I, I've done little bits of fishing here and there but not much. Oh and I need to need to heal up. Probably uh probably stock up on any Pokeballs I need. But yeah this is, this is going to be a pretty chill episode. It's Sunday night. You know? Not a lot happens. She notic. I always forget what their actual names are. I just think of them as what what name I gave them. Welcome to the Pokemart. Uh bye. Yes, okay. Uh I'm gonna buy ten more Ultra Balls. And I'll just I'll fill out three more great balls, just so I don't have an uneven number. Ooh, I really like the design of the Max Potion and the Full Restore. They look, like, very industrial. Like, these look like they're all, uh, appled out and, like, ooh, sleek, nice. But these are just, like, nah, it's just a, it's just a brick. It's just a friggin' brick full of juice that you spray on your Pokemon. I like it. Don't need repels. Not right now. Uh, let's get a revive, just to please my OCD. Alright, and that'll do that. Uh, nope. Uh, jobs. Gotta check in with the jobs, see what's happening. I think... Well, there's new postings. Um, three hours left. Right, because I did it at the end of the stream yesterday. So it still needs some time. Uh, let me see what other jobs we have. Dark Aura. So they want... Dark type. Uh, yeah, I can... Ooh, uh, up to 30. Bugs, I know... Or, no. Mysterious pa So they want, like, Psychic and Fairy, maybe? I don't think I have many. Actually, let me check. Let's see. Um, I'll see what Psychic and Fairy I have. Oh, yeah, I just got, um... High row here. Maybe ghost? I don't think ghost. Uh, sure. We can do La Luna. Hmm. hmm. Hold on. Is there like a... Yes. Okay, the shoulder buttons. I keep going all the way to the top and that felt pretty inefficient. So... What do we got? What do we got? What do we got? Uh, oh, and there's a slowpoke. Winkles. That's why I named him. Because they got r extra wrinkly, like, heads in this version. Poison. Poison is not very helpful for this. Wow, Buffet. Oh, wow. Wow, Buffet is just pure psychic. Really? I thought they'd be, like, psychic fighting or something. Hmm. That's fine by me. That helps me out. 
Oh, and we got. So, oh yeah, <laughs> I na I named this one. I tried to name this one Psych on TBS. Um, I don't know. It it's stupid. I j just like come up with things off the top of my head when it comes to the names. Some improv exercise nonsense. Whole day, send them out. Oh, my laundry is in the shot here. Not that you can really see into there, but like that's that's a little unattractive. Let's just scoot that out of there. Um, fi I don't have a ton of fire type. Ooh. Hmm. Okay, water and fire. I think I got some water type I could send. Yeah, we got... Quake Sire. Here we go. Here we go, Pukumuku. Pukumuku. Hey, uh... What's the name there? Hey, CJ! Thanks for tuning in. This is, this is uh, gonna be a real chill stream tonight, so... Don't expect any too much excitement. How you doing? On this on this wonderful Sunday. Is it a wonderful Sunday for you? It's been it's been okay for me. I got up at like three in the afternoon. I was exhausted. <laughs> I think it was coming off of the excitement of the stream yesterday because it was very eventful, and like coming off of that, I just like had so much adrenaline that I ended up staying up way too late and then crashing really hard. Hmm, plants and flat that'd be grass type, right? Let me see let me see what kind of grass type I got. Hmm. Grass, grass, grass. Oh. Ooh, two ghost grass. That's neat. I do really love all the ghost type Pokemon. If I if I had to pick like, if I had to decide, you know, which type of trainer I'd be, 100% ghost. Oh, sweet! Yeah, um... Hopping from stream to stream to fill out the Pokedex. I'm... I'm working through it. I got about one, uh, almost 1.30, I believe, when I checked earlier. So... Uh, still, still a lot to go, but I'm, I'm cranking through it. I definitely, I just wanted to do all the jobs before I got into it in earnest. And then I'm gonna, I'm gonna be going one by one, pretty much. Hmm. Oh no, I already, I tried to do that, but I didn't have nearly enough dragon types. Nothing too serious. Nets. Bug type? Oh, I got some bug type. Yeah, yeah, let's see. Let's see what we got in terms of bug type. Bug, 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 bug. I know I saw some in here. Come on, come on. Ah, there's one. I only need five. Ah, oh, crustal. I always, I, I, I try not to, but when I'm just like looking through stuff, I tend to start humming along, and then I remember that there's a delay, so that'll probably drive you guys crazy listening to me uh, hum something like uh, like a half a second early. I don't know exactly how much the delay is, and I think it shifts a little bit. But, I don't know. And I know there's a way to, like, like adjust it in OBS. I just... I don't want to, like, mess with that and make it worse, you know? Huh? 
Wow. That's that's a really impressive like thing. <laughs> Is that like your resume basically? Like that's that's I you got the job as far as I'm concerned. That's really impressive. Um yeah, let me see. Let me check my Pokedex again here. Because my plan is... I've seen 241, caught 129. I'm My plan is to go track down all the ones I've seen using the habitat. And then um, once I've got all of those, then I'll start getting the ones I haven't even seen. Uh, I have no idea where the starters are. So if you could let me know where I can find the, the starters out in the world. Is it going to be... A, will I have to trade for them? Because I remember in the original, like, red and blue, you could, um, you could, uh, you could find them in the, the open world. Like, you could find, uh, a Charizard, you could find a, a Squirtle, Bulbasaur, all those. But, yeah, I don't, I don't know with this one. Can't find stars in the wild with this one. Was that ever a thing? Maybe I was wrong. I also only ever played... I, I played yellow. So, I don't know if maybe that was a yellow-specific thing. I don't know. But, uh, yeah, I guess I'll have to trade around for those. That's fine. I'm going to wait until I've gotten most of them before I start doing the trading, because I feel like that's going to be kind of tedious. Do I, I have a Drifloon. Uh, no, I definitely have one of you. No. No! I'm here for, what was it? Critterbug? What is it called? Hold on. Um, Dotler. Dotler is what I'm looking for. Am I in the right place or do I need to be further? No, this is a spot. It was only a yellow thing. Okay. I mean, it was very useful. I remember as a kid struggling so much with yellow because if all you have is the Pikachu... There's not a lot of options that can take on Brock early on. Um, but then I found out from a kid at school, I like, I eavesdropped, I think, but like, I found out that if you go to Victory Road and just like grind in this one tiny grass spot, um, you can get a Mankey and then you have to level it up until it gets low kick and then that can take on Brock, basically. So I did that. And then I did the stupid kid thing of, like, leveling up my Mankey to death. And by the time I got to Koga, I got floored and I couldn't <laughs> I couldn't beat the game. Oh, okay. <laughs> he doesn't appear in the overworld. So that, so I want to find the ones that don't have a model in the grass then, right? Like the little exclamation point, but you don't see anything. Uh, I already have a magic harp, so I'm just gonna run. This is a waste of time. Um, just enjoy the battle music, I guess. Okay. Ooh. Oh, oh, is that him? Nah, that's a low tad. No, a lombra. Low tad's the next one. No, low tad's the one before Lumbra, and then Ludicolo is the the last one. I remember that. That's like that's like Gen two, I think, right? Like that. Sorry, I always I do it the other way, and I know that like in some some places that's a very rude hand gesture. So I don't want to. Not meaning to offend. It's just uh, it's just uh, a very innocent thing in my culture. I know the thumbs up is also apparently in some cultures like incredibly rude. So I try not to do that either. Okay, that's that's definitely good information. I was curious if that was the case. Um so okay, I want to I want to find I want to find the the exclamation. Whoop! There. There. Is that him? Nope. That's an esper. Ah. All right. Yeah, this is this is going to be a very chill kind of grind. My my general schedule is Saturdays I do the more exciting stuff in this game and then Sundays are like chill, just like grinding, trying to get through the Pokédex. 
Got a long way to go with that. Nope, nope. Nope, 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 nope. Oh, oh, there's one. What do we got? It's... Applin! Not what I was looking for, but I think I don't have him. So, that might be... Yes, I do not have an Applin, so... Uh, I don't even need an Ultra Ball on that, I think. Honestly, maybe just a Pokeball would be fine. Let me, let me try a Pokeball. I'm, like, so high level as far as that goes. Oh, wow, 5%. All right, I'm gonna, yeah, I'm definitely gonna have to check it out. Okay, that did not work, so I'm gonna hit him with Spore and then a Pokeball. Oh, app okay. Crap, so this is actually like, yeah, this is actually a, a big deal that I ran into this, I guess. Cool. Um, I wasn't paying attention. Did Spore not work? <laughs> Let me try that again. It doesn't affect him. Okay, um... Well, I'm going to be very careful then. In that case, if this is a big deal, I'll just use the Ultra Ball. Like, I don't mind. And then Dinon, that, wow, that shirt. The character shirt with the Pikachu? Yeah. Yeah, it's really great. There's a reverse version where it's an, uh, the Eevee on the front looking all there. Uh, and then on the back, the Pikachu. I really love it. Um, Ultra Ball. Oh, is that what it is? Okay. I did not realize that. That that explains a lot. I yeah. I, I don't know a lot of the inside baseball stuff. I know that like EVs and IVs exist, and I think I watched a video explaining them, but it kinda kinda just fell out of my mind. Cause it's so so technical. Applin Applin, the Apple Core Pokemon. As soon as it's born, it burrows into an apple. Not only does the apple serve as its food source, but the flavor of the fruit determines its evolution. Want to give Applin a nickname? Yes. We're going to call the Applin a uh, Fuji. Or no. Let's go with Gala. Whoops. Oh, no. Oh, I messed that up. Whoops. I was just trying to erase... And I messed it up. That's fine. It's just for fun. So I was going to name him Gala. But that, whatever. You guys know that at least. So that's that's all that really matters. Uh, ooh, and I'm still looking for Dotler. So let's... Whoa, come on. There we go. Dotler, Dotler. Nope. Esper. Hmm. Uh, yeah, just gonna run. Shouldn't have any problem running from these fights <laughs> at this level. Uh, alright, what else? Sneaking. Sne Whoop. What do you got? What are you? Dotler? Nope. Wait, is... Did I just accidentally run into the spritzy that was out there, or was that the random encounter? Hmm. I don't know. Whatever. Oop. Sometimes, um, this water bottle has, like, a valve on it because it's meant for, like, bike riding. So they won't just, like, spray everywhere, but... Ah, here we go. Dotler. Perfect. Um. But, uh, yeah, that means that sometimes it gets air trapped in it, and it just makes a lot of noise. It's a very noisy water bottle, so I try and mitigate that by keeping it away from the mic. Yeah, I, I'm shocked it took so long. I figured it wasn't that, um, big a deal. Let's see. Okay. Uh, I don't want to use an Ultra Ball on this. I th I'm going to move back to the Pokeballs. Let's see if it'll work. Just a plain Jane Pokeball. Now, does Spore work on bug types? Because my main plan right now is to use mostly Spore. 
Ah. Very close. Very close. Let's try one more. That was very close. I think one more time might do it. Come on, he's worn down. Nope. Okay. Okay, if Spore works, I'll try a Spore on Dotler here and see if that works. I just want to be careful because my Pokemon are so so over-leveled for this area that they're just going to wreck shop on anybody they run into. Alright, go, go in the ball. Go in the ball now, bud. It's, it's nice and cushioned. You can just relax. Have a snooze. There we go. Got it. Okay. <clears throat> so that's two in the bank. One apparently pretty rare. So that's that was pretty lucky. It's, it's surprising I got the rare one before the, the kind of common one. Ah, Dotler, the Redome Pokemon. As it grows inside its shell, it uses its psychic ability... It, it uses its psychic abilities to monitor the outside world and prepare for evolution. Hmm. Yeah. We'll go with, uh... Observatory. Observa... Dash... Tory. That's what the... That's what the shape makes me think of. Perfect. Exactly 12. Ugh, yeah, follow bots. Wow, t Jeez, three in a row. Okay, um... Yeah, we're gonna... Can ban those real quick. I don't need to give a reason... <laughs> for banning them, guys. It's... Or, well, may okay, maybe I should, uh... Spam. Ban. Man, I've gotten one of those at a time before, but like three at a time, jeez. Sorry about that, everybody. Um, oh, you can trade me the starters. Uh, yeah, maybe if you're around towards the end of the stream, um, I think, yeah, that would, or, well, you know what, yeah, let, uh, if you don't mind, like, uh, I feel like I should get, get those now so that, um, I can just have that out of the way. For later, because I'm gonna I'm gonna have a good few streams where I where I need to uh, grind through some stuff. So I'll just get these berries. Nice. Shake it more. And three. Okay. Three's enough. I'm I'm good with that. Whoa! Coming at me, jeez. Hey, hey, slow it down. Slow it down. Okay. Alright, anything else in this route that I need? Uh, Berescuda and Lantern. Hmm. No. Let me, let me check. Can I check from the map? Okay. Um. Hmm. No, it doesn't save from the map. Well, I'll just go with the one by ones. Uh, yeah, yeah. Um. I can, yeah, I can do that on stream. I don't know if you'd want to do the the the. Um, what was it? I did it yesterday. With Wolf. Uh, it was like a. Link ID? Right. I think that's that'd be the way to do it, right? But yeah, wait, whenever you want to, I can just hop in and uh, do that. I have I have Grookey. I need uh, Sobble and Scorebunny. Scorebunny is the third one. Oh. oh, wow. Lots of stuff on this bridge. Whoop! Come on now. Hmm. Oh. 
No. Oh. Man. <sighs> A lot of stuff early on in this game. Um, let me see where would be my next stuff. Oh, you got the code set up. Perfect. Um, okay, so... Let me ch I remember how to do this. It's... Connect to the internet. And then... Link trade... Link code. Uh, it's what one five seven five one five seven five. When you set that up, do you get to like choose the code, or is it randomly assigned? Bam! Link code. All right, connecting. Oh, oh. Okay, that's pretty good. Hey, time for a trade. Okay. I will send you... Ah! Uh, oh, not Mnuchin. Uh, Electrike, I think. I mean, unless, is there a specific one you want? I do have quite a few here. Um... Yeah, my first my first instinct would be electric. Okay, cool. Yeah, I'll just do electric then. And trade it. Okay. Hopefully, hopefully the stream does not mess up the connection. It, it might go slow, but so far I haven't had too many problems with it. Hmm. Yes. Yes. Here we go. Sleek. And I have score bunny. Boy hopping. Yeah, I really love all the starters from this generation. Like, Rookie is my man, but, like, they're all pretty sick. Um, Score Bunny. The, whoops, that was a bit much. <laughs> Score Bunny, the rabbit Pokemon. It has special pads on the back of it, backs of its feet and one on its nose. Once it's raring to fight, these pads radiate tremendous heat. Hmm. Yeah, yeah, I'll, I'll definitely take you up on that sometime, CJ. Um, I... I I want to at least catch some of the easier ones, but if I'm having trouble with any of the, like, rarer ones, I'll definitely hit you up for that. Uh, yeah, give me that league card. What do we got? I'll, oh, well, I'll check it in a minute, I guess. Hidden ability starters. Ooh. What does that mean? Then I'll also send you Prom Queen. Trade it. Trade it. I like this. I'm glad you guys are wheeling and dealing in the chat. That's that's what I'm all about. Feet and head like a soccer player. Yeah. Yes. There we go. Got Sobble. And I'll probably just train those up to get the... I mean, I think I'll have to, so... Uh, Sobble, the water lizard Pokemon. When it gets wet, its skin changes color, and this Pokemon becomes invisible as if it were camouflaged. Mm. Yeah, organization is definitely something I should work on too. I got all these like big gaps because I keep sending them out on jobs and stuff. Hmm. Well, yep. Yeah. Uh, yes, I appreciate that. 
a great deal, Sean. Thank you very much for the starters. That definitely saves me a great deal of time. Um, So let's see what next I'm going to go for here. Next up. Oh, I should actually show you guys, since I was talking about starters. Uh, I wear this not too often on the stream because, like, my computer gets crazy hot and the whole room gets warm. But I have this sick uh, Rowlet hoodie. You can probably see a little Rowlet uh, patch on it. it. says Rowlet across the back. Can you read that? It's a little, It's a little faded. I've had it for quite a while. Yeah, the inside's all, like, green with Pokeballs and stuff. I've had it for quite a while. It's way too big for me. But that, I, I kind of like that. It makes it feel, like, real real snuggly and warm. You know? You just been playing space. It's pretty nice. Um, yeah, Rowlet was also my choice in uh, Sun and Moon because it, he's, like, a big-time dramatic theater kid. Like, how could I not? So that's two, two, gra Sorry, two grass in a row. Um, I don't know if that's just because I prefer, I guess, of the original stars, I also prefer Bulbasaur. Huh. I guess I just gravitate towards the grass. Weird. I never even realized that about myself. You learn new things about yourself all the time. All right. Let's see. Habitat. Uh, ooh. Let's see. I could go down there. Hmm. But up in here. Uh, I'll, I think I'll go down here for it. Let me... Oh, I can flying taxi straight there. Oh, and thank you very much for the follow, CJ. I just noticed that. Take a second to follow you back. I can't guarantee that I will always follow everyone back, but uh, as it stands right now, I'm doing my best to, to keep up with it. And that brings me to 45, five away from affiliate. That's awesome. I definitely, I had a rough time for a while because I, uh, yeah, I, I was just like not getting much attention to the stream. I don't know, but th things are looking up. It's pretty sick, pretty nice. Tiny mushroom. Oh, that's, okay, I definitely have a Growlithe. Um, that's a Stuffle, oh. You, what are you? It's a stuffle. Dang, I already got one of those. I think. I have to, right? Yeah, I'm positive. Yes, yes. Level nine. Oh man. I'm 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 pretty strong for this area. Also, did I did I follow Jason? I didn't, huh? I guess I lost a follower. Since yesterday. Weird. Hmm. I didn't know... I guess... I mean... I don't know. I, I feel like I, I will notice less over time as the count go... Whoa. As the count goes up, but like... Right now, like... I have so few followers that anytime there's a change, it's it's almost an event. Uh, oh, I haven't done any fishing in the wild areas. Let me let me hit that up. Hmm. Oh. I apologize. I I reacted a little before it happened on your guys' screen. There's a slight delay. Th that's why I need to get the HD 60s plus because then it'll be a one to one. Right now, there's like a a brief delay between what I see and what you guys see. So. Apologies. I, I try to line up with the uh, the actual stream as best I can. Okay, I don't have a shelter, so I mean, Poke I'm five times stronger, so I think Pokeball should be fine. Hmm. Yes, got it. Similarly, a little inside baseball. I actually see it's about one little bump. So, like, there's the three bumps, and then you get it. So, I see the first bump, and then the second one, and when the second one happens on my screen, the first one happens for you guys. So, I always, like, wait until I see it happen on that screen before I actually react. So, a lot of times, I know I didn't get it, but I kind of fake the reaction. I, 
Listen, I'm an actor. I can do it pretty okay. I want to keep you guys in on the excitement. I don't know. <laughs> wow, a whole 15 XP. Nice. Shelter, the bivalve Pokemon. Its hard shell repels any kind of attack. It is vulnerable only when its shell is open. Yes. We're going to name him Clam. That's C L A Y U M. Clam. Listen. I react in my mind and I save it, basically. I. <laughs> it's, it's. 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 I mean. Okay. Listen. There's, there's concessions you gotta make when you're doing something like this with, uh. Not the best equipment. You know, I'm, I'm streaming from a laptop. I'm using a device that doesn't exactly gel well with MacBooks to begin with. So. I feel like the stream's pretty okay, given all of the things I have to make concessions for. Revive. Similarly, I think I do pretty well, especially considering I can't use Streamlabs, because it's, it's not supported on Mac. At least it wasn't the last time I checked. Yeah, I, I figured you were just razzling me. It's all good. Um... Yeah, Streamlabs would be helpful. I, I definitely would love to put up the, like, reaction-y stuff. And I could probably figure out how to do it, just, like, without Streamlabs. It's just... Uh, I already put so much work into the stream that I'm like... Uh, I'll, I'll just wait until I can get, like, an actual gaming PC, specifically. Rather than try and do more... Because, like, it's I've already done about as much as I'm going to be able to get out of this this particular thing. Um, oh, everybody's checking this. What's up? Energy pouring. 300 watts. Oh, whoa. Uh. Oh, right. These are the big. Let me try this out. I actually haven't done one of these. Um. It's versus. That's one of those. The. the ow, I can't remember what they're called, but. Uh, Shinotic should be okay. Uh, I don't really have anybody specific to invite, so I'm just gonna... Or maybe I should? Don't invite. Invite? Don't invite. Ah! Uh. Inv well, let me see what happens when I hit invite. Okay, it just lets other people join in. Gotcha. Cool. Well, we'll give that a minute, see if anybody hops in. I don't think I'll need to. Unless, I mean, is this one of the Dynamax fights? I mean, I know that those are a thing, but I, 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 I've been like cruising through this game pretty quick, so I've honestly missed a lot of the content. If it, if it gets to a minute thirty left and nobody's joined, I'll just hit the ready battle. Oh, okay. Then I want to say if it's a Dynamax raid, then I definitely want to wait for others. All right. Uh, let's see how long this takes. Figured I'd bring back something. I haven't done this in a minute, but when I play, like, online board games or something, I just kind of, while I'm waiting for other people's turns to be over, just kind of do some card trick stuff. Whoop, whoop, ah! Ah, shoot. I dropped a bunch of them. Oh, it's not a good start. Oh, that's a bad omen. <laughs> uh, hold on. I'm going to pick those up. I think I got all of them. I gotta count them real quick. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, tw
4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26. Okay. <coughs> And as is tradition, when I screw up a card trick as well, I'm gonna do a Pharaoh Shuffle. Get those together. Oop. Dropped a couple, that's okay. I'm just gonna, gonna do a uh, water bending. Oop. Oh man, I'm a little out of practice. <laughs> uh, ooh, do I wanna do this by myself? Or, whoop. <sighs> Tried to click it with my mouse. I'm a fool. Uh, nope. I'm panicking. I'm out. <laughs> I'm out. I don't want to do that by myself for the first time. Is, it, is there a way for me to join in on them? Because it looks like they're getting set up. Uh, I'll try. I'll try again later. Right now, I'm uh. Or is there a way for me to join in there? How do I join in on their thing? I'm trying to I'm trying to join in. Uh oh. I hope I didn't just screw myself over there. No, okay. Or well ah, oh, those are like NPCs. Shoot, I was trying to join in with everybody else. That's fine. That's fine. Okay, uh, well, I will use Spore to see. I don't know if that's going to work on a Dynamax. Let's find out. Jeez. Did not. Uh, okay. Oh no, how many, like, attacks do they get? Okay, Spore, go sleep. Yes! Okay, that did work, so that's pretty good. Oh no, that did very little damage. Alright, and then I'm gonna... Oh, I gotta build it up, okay. Uh, I'll hit with Moonblast. That should be pretty useful. Nope. Woke back up. Uh-oh. Blue screen. How do I do blue screen? Huh. I'll I'll have to I'll figure it out later. Um Yeah, I'm just going to hopefully survive this. Hmm. Like where you go. Oh. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. After I finish this up, we'll check that out. Although by then, I I might take a break after this one. It's about the hour mark. Got it. You gotta get up and move around. It's not good for you to sit for too long. Bad for your legs. Bad for your heart. Uh, I'll hit with spore again. That seems pretty useful. I like that anteater Pokemon, but I do not like his his weird stovepipe tail. That's a weird detail, and I don't appreciate it. Spore. Crap. Come on, let's try it again. Oh boy. Okay, okay. I'm good, I'm good. Oh, okay, I see. We have to knock down those four notches before we even do anything to it. Shoot. Okay. Oh, sweet. I can Dynamax. 
I'm gonna do that then. Gonna hit you with Max Starfall. Big. A very mysterious noise. Okay. No, don't do that. No! Well, crap. That didn't work out for me. Oh boy. Okay. Okay, so I'm guessing that's gonna come back then. Oh, cheer on! Let's do it. Doing a lot of that, my dude. It's not very helpful. Perfect. And I'm guessing my Dynamax is that. Yeah, that was all I got. Well, shoot. That's fine. Oh no! Not immediately. Come on. Stop, Martin. We need some offense, my dude. Get him. Perfect. Whoa. Good, good. All right, let's let's hit him with uh, Spore again. Let everybody get a couple of free shots. No, okay. <sighs> that was coming after me again. Oh, whoa! What? They can just kick you out of the raid? Oh. Oh man, that's pretty anticlimactic. Shoot. Okay. Well. <laughs> That's fine, that's fine. Um, okay, let me check. Let me check here. So if I just select one of these, does that do it? Hmm. Oh, kicks you out if you have four faints or ten turns back. Right. Okay, that makes sense. Well, shoot. Um, okay. I'm probably going to do another one of those after I come back, but I'm going to take a quick break, get some more water, all that stuff, do some jumping jacks, you know, keep my blood flowing. But don't touch that internet dial. Don't go anywhere, folks. I'll be RB.
Hey everybody, I am back. Uh, I'm gonna take another shot. Well, okay, I'm just gonna keep an eye out, and if there are any other raid battles, I wanna join in in at least one with actual people. But, um, for now, I'm gonna keep searching for that Butterfree. Said they'd be here. Let me, let me double check. But it, whoops. Habitat. Where's it at? Yeah, but it, this is the region to find it, so. <sighs> Gonna keep an eye out. Hmm. Yeah, there's, uh, there's a lot of... Not Mudsdale. What is it? Or is this Mudsdale? No, Mudsdale's the evolution. That's, um... Well, and don't tell me. Uh... Oh, I know. It's like one of my favorites. I love this guy. It's, um... Don Donkey Man. What? What is it? Stompy? Stomp Stompos. Uh... He heavy Man. I already have a Pancham. I'm good on that one. The, um... Cli Cliff Clifford. Clifford the largest dog. Uh I don't know, it'll come to me later. <laughs> I don't know. Okay, I've tried my best. <laughs> Pokemon names are weird. Oh, I should have healed up. Um Clarence. No. Uh Ke Kevin? No, these are just names. Hold on, what's a Pokemon name? Um, Digsby. No. <sighs> Not Lombre. Lorenz is what I named mine. Hold on. Can I just, can I cheat? Can I cheat? It will it tell me what the original is? No. Hmm, it's... Stop, uh... Keep thinking Stompy. Why is that? Um, is that close? K uh, starts with an M. Mastodon. No. Uh, it's. It's not Mudsdale, right? This one's Mudsdale, I think. It's. M more, 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 more of them. You, what are you? What are you? Man, Manny, Manny Rivera. No, that's El Tigre. Uh, it's. Oh come on, come on, brain. You know this one. It's in there somewhere. I could just like run into one and find out, but I don't. I. At this point, oh, actually, I'm looking for something. Nope, oh, well, okay. It's Mudbray! Ah! Oh, hey, thanks for the, uh, thank you for the raid, European Warrior. Ah, really appreciate it. We're having a really chill time right now, just kind of grinding stuff out. I was, I was trying desperately to remember Mudbray's name, but then I ran into one, so. Gonna marker that for a highlight. That's this is pretty funny. Oh, what are you? Are you a free? No, no, it's a Minuchin, Minchino. Whoops. Mm, I do love Minchino, but I already have one. I appreciate that it's it's spelt like cappuccino. Was that was that one of the ones from like the the region that's supposed to be France? I think that was XY. That's another mud bray. Run. <sighs> Trying for a butterfree right now. I I have not found one yet. And if there's a I'm Looking also to join raid battle at some point if one pops up. No, I definitely have a Growlithe. Come on. Come on, Pokemon. Give me my butterfly. 
I, I, I am your little butterfly. Green, black, and blue in the colors in the sky. Uh, whoa, 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 watch out. Ooh. Whoa, oh, oh, wait a minute. Uh, no, I don't want to run into the growl of the mud bray. Let me get the... Let me get the random... Oh, there he is. Come on. Yes, you. Hit me. What's up? Now it's a mud bray. Minchino was Gen 5. Gen 5 was Unova, right? Right? That's the one that's like New York, I think. Isn't it? Hold on, hold on, let me run through them. It's, uh, Kanto is the first one. Then Johto was the second. I, it all gets kind of hazy after that, to be honest. Um, I know Unova's in there somewhere. Um, I read that webcomic uh, X and Y Adventures, or whatever it was. Black and White Adventures? It was pretty funny. Um... Hmm. Yes. Yes. Okay. Unova it was. Perfect. Whoa. Whoa. Oh, geez. The, like, camera kind of jolted. Whoa. I'm not getting drift in my wired controller now, am I? That would suck. I literally... I got this thing specifically to avoid drift. Oh, well. Hmm. Nope. Maybe I should go further afield. See if I can get... Oh! You. Come on. What are you? It's... A Stuffle. I might need to reset my Elgato in a second. I'm hearing a clip. Anytime I try and get up ahead of it, though, I just... Yep, yep, okay, that's definitely... Hold on one second, gotta reset the Elgato. Just takes a few seconds, folks. Apologies, apologies. Oh, yeah, the Joy-Con drift is so bad. I have, I had, um... I, I got my Switch at launch, and within just, like, a couple months, the Joy-Con that came with it was drifting. Uh, we have, like, six sets between all of us or something, and I think only one set is not drifting. Apparently, if you fill out, like, a form, you can send your Joy-Con back to Nintendo and they will replace it. Um, or, like, fix it or something. I don't know. But they'll, they'll do it for free, I believe. Uh, I don't remember if that's on the official Nintendo site, but that'd be something to look into. You might be able to get it uh, fixed up for free. Um, it'd be a pain, but it'd be something. Yeah, this controller is pretty good. Um, it's a what is it? It's a PDP wired uh, face-off controller, I think it's called, because it's like the this red plate here can like pop off and be replaced with another one. I don't know where you get the other plates, but I'm okay with this one. I don't really like the look of it. I'm not super big on that, but the uh, the texture is super nice. It's got a kind of like um, kind of like a vinyl texture. Which I really, really enjoy. Oh yeah, that's right. With like all the joy, of all the switches selling out, and like, yeah, everybody's spending way more time playing Switch now. Probably, I can totally imagine them being super backed up. Uh. I wonder if they're handling that in the warehouse. Hmm. I should text some of the people. I um, A little bit of background for myself. I've worked in two of the Nintendo warehouses. Uh, I worked in the Kirkland warehouse in Kirkland, Washington during the uh, original um, Wii U launch. And they had the whole, like, everything takes forever to download, so we had to do, like, a whole thing where we basically pre-installed all the updates and stuff. And then I worked in the... Um, the North Bend. Uh, oh, wait a minute. There's a raid battle. Join in. There we go. Um, 
But yeah, I worked that one during the original Amiibo launch, which was also bananas. And that's like uh, North Bend is the like the main distribution facility for all of Nintendo of America. So we were so we were very busy for that holiday season. A little thing, uh, a little insider information for you guys. So early on, like the it was the villager, the Wii Fit trainer, and I think another amiibo sold out, quote unquote. But the reality is we had like multiple pallets of those still left over in the warehouse. It's just that the retailers were not ordering them. So that that was not Nintendo's fault. They actually had the stock. It's just nobody was ordering them. Yeah, um, when you work for Nintendo, they um, they basically have like a little kiosk with a computer where you can order through their internal ordering site, and you get a, that's all discounted. Um, I was broke. I was super broke because I wasn't getting paid super well, so I couldn't really get anything. Um, the cool thing is not so much the discounts; it's the employee garage sale. This is this is a Nintendo secret. Kind of, I mean, it's not really secret, it's just like an employee benefit, but basically every year uh, they will basically take all of their back stock and they will sell it at massive discount to the employees and it'll just be like in the like break room or whatever and they'll just set it all up. Um, and so they, I was able to get in 2012, it was in 2012 when the Wii U launched, I was able to get a Game Boy Advance SP still in box that had been in the warehouses for like since the Game Boy Advance SP was being sold. And I got it for $25. And like they just had like tons of games that were like crazy cheap, like a dollar each. Um, there was one time where they came out with just like this big box full of these like squishy, I might actually have it here. Um, well, this isn't it, but like a stress ball, right? And it, it, the, they were star-shaped, and they all had numbers on them. And basically, they were doing a raffle, and everybody got one. And then they were like, okay, these three numbers get a 3DS XL, just for free. They just gave it to them with a game. Um... And at another point, they just had, like, they just brought out into the break room. They're like, hey, here's a huge box of just old promotional pins and stuff. So, like, they, they had, like, pens from, like, old corporate events. They had, like, I got, like, a little Star Fox pin, like, the little lapel pin that he wears. Um, they had, like, these, the, the uh, like, dog collar that was, like, Nintendogs themed. And it was just, they were just like, take whatever you want. So, like, there, there are tons of cool benefits from working there. But the hours kind of suck because at, if it's not the holiday season and you're not a salaried employee of Nintendo, if you're just like a temp worker, you basically go in in the morning, they pick like however many people they actually need for the day and then everybody else has to go home and you're only paid by the hour. So that kind of sucked, but the, the benefits were really, really cool. The work also really sucked, to be clear. It was like you just stand. You just stand at a conveyor belt, and it's basically just open a box, open the next box, open the next box, and you do that for four hours. You go to lunch, and then when you come back, they switch you to a different position where it's like put a sticker on a box, put a sticker on a box, uh, load the thing into the box, and that that's like the whole job so it was it was incredibly mind-numbing but it it was interesting it was very interesting it was it it was really fun because like a lot of the people there were really not the kind of people who know anything about nintendo they were just people looking for a job there was this one like older lady i worked with when we did the amiibo launch and it was really fun because every time they showed a new amiibo came through she would just kind of comment on it because she'd never seen these characters before so like when she saw the pit amiibo she's like oh it's a little angel boy i was like yeah it is um when she saw like the mega man amiibo she's like oh look at this cute little guy it's like yeah he is cute <laughs> oh it, it was kind of fun 
They also had in the break room, uh, they had just like a, a sort of, uh, uh, like the, the cappuccino machine you'd have in like a gas station that has like the hot chocolate, cappuccino, mocha, and it's just like, it just dispenses it. They had that for free, so you could just have as many of those as you wanted. So that was my lunch a lot of days. <laughs> Because I just, I didn't feel like uh, making a lunch and like most of the, the restaurants were like enough of a, enough of a distance away that I wouldn't be able to make it there and back during my lunch hour. I don't know. It, it was, it was not the best time, but it was a very, very interesting time. Whoops. Ah, oh, crap. Oh, is that how that works? Oops. <laughs> well, aren't I the fool? Oh yeah, it wasn't it wasn't a difficult job working in the warehouse. It was just like very boring. So it's like yeah, you don't get like crazy tired, but like you got to like come up with some way to entertain your own mind. Shoot. Okay, I'll remember that. I want to do at least one raid with other people before the end of this stream, but I'm figuring it out. I don't know. It's it's surprising because they're very like handholdy with a lot of the other aspects of this game that they're um not super forthcoming about that. Uh, I already have a Badoo. I do not need this. Yeah, I just figured because it looked like it was loading that it was um that it was like waiting for other people. I didn't realize I needed to hit the whatever. I'll I'll get it next time. Whoa! whoa! Oh, he's coming in hot. Oh, here he comes. Okay. Oh, oh. Don't want to miss this. What is this? A single Pokeball. Oh, whoop. Hmm. I also really want to get this Butterfree before the end of the stream. Whoa. Oddish. I'm pretty sure I have an Oddish, but let's double check here. Mm, yeah. I already got one. Whoa, whoa. Oh. I'm too used to avoiding the uh, random encounters. All right. Oh, oh, Metapod. Definitely have a Metapod. What do you got? What do you got? Are you a Butterfree? No, it's an Oddish. Hmm. Rotten. Oof, I'm getting a lot of um I'm getting a lot of messages about uh about I'm just getting a lot of those messages they're implying that I should do a camp soon, so I might do that in a bit. I want to at least get this butterfree first though, cuz like I I started out with like getting two, but if I only get like three a stream, ooh, I'm going to be at this for a while. You know what? That's fine though. Do I have one of you? I might. I might. I definitely have a low punny. Is that a low punny evolution? I do have a digger's V. Okay, don't need it. Come on, where's a butterfree? Where's a butterfree at? Butterfree. I well, no, I already have a Tyrogue. Whoa! Oh man, it is really unsettling how they just sprint at you. Especially because they, they, they're humanoid enough that it's like, I don't know, it's kind of creepy. Oh, get, no, oh, I wanted to get whatever the, uh, whatever the random one was. Whoops, nope, nope, I'm just running. 
I'm just running. Don't got time to fight them all. Butterfree. Yeah. Um. I get that. I, it feels like if they want, really want to catch you, they definitely could. But I'm, I'm able to avoid them as long as I'm not off guard. As long as if I see them, I'm usually able to outrun them. Butterfree. <laughs> oh, excuse me. That was some weird thing caught in my sinuses. Ugh. Butterfree, come to me. Come here. Pretty sure I got the Sonics. Let me double check. Because I remember this was the first, like, big wild area Pokemon that I ran into. Yeah. Hmm. Whoop. Whoa! Oh wait, wait, wait! The routes. Come here. Give me. Ah, oh, dang it! <laughs> Shoot! Whoa! <sighs> oh, yep. Damn it! Every time I'm just like, nope, run, and I'm like, no, wait. I want, I want to hit them. I just, I panic for a second, and I'm like, huh, coming at me. I literally did it again just after I <laughs> mentioned it. Bunnel B, Bunnel B, okay. There's a, there's a lot of rabbit ones. At least three, I guess. I don't know. I don't know about a lot. Oh, oh what's happening? That's a metapod. I don't want that. Whoa. There we go. It's a Badoo. Dang it. Just one, one butterfly. Just one, please. I don't even need the whole set. Just give me one. Let me get just one. Oh, okay. I did get the random encounter at least. Not exactly what I wanted, but you know what? That's fine. Run away. That's the other thing that often happens, <laughs> is I accidentally hit the wrong direction and just run straight back into the one I was trying to avoid. Oh well. Butterfree isn't a random encounter. Oh, so I can just ignore those, okay. Pr appreciate the info. Um, okay, let me just, yeah, track them one down then. We also, I didn't uh, mention anything because we kind of rocketed past it in the last stream, but I hit 400 views, which is pretty, pretty legit. I'm actually, I'm practically to 500 at this point. Oh, I don't think I have one of you. Do I have one of you, Rosalia? Come on. Tell me. Now I do. Oh, you're gonna... Oh, yeah, it looks like... Max Raid Battle. Let me see... Oh, okay. So, yeah, that's old. 
I'll give you. Okay, okay, I see. So that's the one raid battle icon. Not the looking for raid battle. Whoa, watch out. Whoa, oh, nah. East Lake Axwell and Rolling Fields. Okay, yeah, that was my other question was like, am I even in the right part of the wild area? Um, where am I at right now? This is... This is the Rolling Fields. Okay, so this is... This is the spot I want to be in. Hmm? Uh, oh! These little guys. I'm pretty sure I got one of those guys. Eh, it doesn't hurt to double check. I don't... I don't like the way they undulate. Doesn't look... Very pleasing. Okay, nothing. Oh, wait a minute. Is that the butterfree noise? No, it wasn't. Hmm. Oh. Item. Tiny mushroom. That's, that's not bad. Oh. Wait a minute, do I have one of you yet? I have a Pancham. I don't know if I have the big boy. Pangoro. Or Pangoro would be. Right? Yeah. No, I do not. Perfect. Okay. Uh, we're gonna put you to sleep and then hit you with an Ultra Ball. Ultra Ball, where are you at? Come on, come on. Two. Three. Good, okay. We got him. Pangoro's data. Pangoro. Daunting Pokemon. Using its leaf, Pangoro can predict the moves of its opponents. It strikes with punches that can turn a dump truck into scrap with just one hit. That's terrifying. <laughs> That's so strong. We're gonna name you... Riz. Uh... Wait? Yeah, yeah, no, that's fine. Um... Riz is a bear character in Beastars, uh, which has not shown up in the anime yet. It, uh, he definitely will this next season. I'm pretty sure I saw him in the trailer, but... Y'all will see what that's about. I don't want to get into spoilers for the anime. The The manga finished, and I would highly recommend reading it, because it's, it's... Oh, it's fantastic. But... Yeah, if, if you have not, I don't want to... I don't want to give anything away. There are definitely a lot of huge surprises coming. Like, they're the kind of twists that are so, like, so bananas that you're just, as soon as it happens, you're like, I didn't even think of that as an option. I, <laughs> I can't really ex describe it any better without giving an example, so I'll, I'll leave it at that for right now. Uh, those are link trades, okay. Hmm. Nope, 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 nope. I'm still in rolling fields, right? Yes, yes. Hmm, maybe I should just train up my Metapod at this point. What does that icon mean? Uh, double battles. Ooh, a max raid battle, perfect. Hmm, oh, I guess they're not. Inviting people in. Tears. Oh well. 
or maybe it just was too early. No, it won't let me join. Whatever. So I'm, whoop. I want to stay in the rolling fields. Come on. Come on, Butterfree. Where you at? Where are you at, my friend? Is there anything I can do to entice you further? Anything at all. Hmm. Whoa. Butterfree. Oh, hello. You're cute. I like your style. Anyways. Oh, no. Do I have one of you, pigeon? Come here. Come here. Let me catch you. Pidoov. Oh, it's a pigeon. It's a pigeon and a dove. Now I already have one. I'll set you free, pal. Where? Oh, nope, nope. That's the same one again. I still in. Uh, where is the border to the rolling hills? The rolling fields, I should say. Okay, it's along the lake here, so let me s swoop down here, see if I can catch one of those guys. <laughs> Whoop! <laughs> the pop-in freaks me out a little bit. Especially when they're on a bike, because then it's like a whole whole situation pops in all at once. Come on, where's a where Butterfree at? Hmm. No. That sounds kind of like a Butterfree, but that's the Bunnel Bees. So that's not helping me out a ton. Uh, hmm. East, am I... Hold on, let me see here. Rolling Fields. Then East Lake Axwell. Okay, at worst I'm just gonna end up running into the other spot they could pop up, so... Or, right? Yeah, that's... Or, wait. Yes... Yes. Yes! Okay. Hold on. Let me check this corner over here. Just want to be sure I'm not missing out on a possibility. Oh my god, there's so many bundle bees. Oh, secret. Jar of honey. Delicious. Honey is very good for you. Obviously, it's still sugar, so you shouldn't have too much of it, but it's antibiotic. It's great for your for your throat. Um, it's anti-inflammatory. And it's one and a half times sweeter than sugar, so you can use, like, a third less than you would of sugar. Get the same sweetness. Yeah. Um, very good for you. Specifically raw honey, though. If you get ones that aren't raw honey, they're basically just like corn syrup with honey flavoring. So be sure to be sure to check that you're getting the good stuff. Is that no? That's like somebody on a bike. Hmm. Uh, let me see if I don't want to like zoom past them, but like feel like I could be covering more ground. By cycling. Ooh. Oh, good. A Pokeball. Hmm. Now 
Now, if I go down there, is that still part of East Lake Axwell, or am I going to be going... Whoop, sorry. Going into uh, another area. Let's find out. And it gives you a notification when you leave an area, right? So, oh. Oh, okay. Somebody, like, burst into existence for a split second. Yep, yep, that's too far. Boy, Butterfree has given me some troubles. I feel like it shouldn't be this rare. I guess it is like a, a, a fairly popular Pokemon, though, so maybe they maybe they made the seed rate very low to entice people to try. No, no, I'm in the west. I'm in the west lake. Oh, oh, Butterfree! There! No, come back! Come back, I want you! No! Oh. Well. Shoot. I can't remember if I have a Wingle. Let me, let me give this check. Man. There it was! I don't have a Wingle, okay. Let's hit you with a standard Pokeball. I think I might have scared it away because I was on the bike. I don't know. Well, there's the Wingle at least. I still got a few, so I'm not too, too broken up, but I would definitely like to get a Butterfree before the end of the stream. Wingle, the seagull Pokemon. It soars on updrafts without flapping its wings. It makes a nest on sheer cliffs at the sea's edge. Uh, yeah, we're gonna call, um... Nope. Whoops. Uh, I did the same thing as that I did with the Applin. I, tr I tried to, uh, backspace and I accidentally backed out. Oh well. Man, I literally never did that before this stream. Oh! Raid battle. Or, ooh, who do I want to raid? I think... Let's, let's raid... Oh, is that a Vaporeon? Yeah! Oh, nope. Oh, they're locked. I see, I see. Okay. Start a challenge. Start a challenge. Let's do it. Uh, what? Can I can I try that again? Communicating. Start. No, no partner found. What does that mean? Hey, get out of here, Stuffle. Uh. What? Oh, okay, I get it. They probably were already communicating with the other one, so it was technically filled up already. Oh, Butterfree! No, come back! Come back! No! Hmm. Or they cancel it. Yeah, that's probably an option, too. Butterfree! Please! Please! No, come back! Come back! Okay, well, this is the spot where it's going to pop up. Um, oh, hey. Hello. The standard model. It's been a while. Ooh, camp. Actually, I should camp. Can I Can I join their camp? Yes. Yeah, they're all... Sca is it because my Pokemon are so high level? Would that have any factor in it? Because I could change up my team if need be. But, yeah, I'm just having the worst... Worst trouble, they don't want to hang out. Hey, hey, she know Ooh, they got the Ponyta. Or no, that I think that's the Rapidash, even. Uh, yeah, you can hang out. What's up, bud? What's happening? Do, do, do. Wow! Oh, you're so strong. Oh, jeez. 
Do it, do it. Yeah. Oh, uh, hello. Uh, what is it? Owo nani kare kore? Owo nani kore. Okay. Hello. How you doing? Oh, maybe they don't like the whistling. Is that a thing? Oh, wow. I mean, I don't know why I'm hanging out with the other... I think he has Pokemons, but all right. Wow. All right. I want to get one more music note at you. Make sure that you're all happy. Come on. Come on. Hmm. Maybe, maybe you want the ball? You want the ball? Go get it. Wait. Whoa. Jeez. Run by real quick. Uh, nope. She's not it. Okay. There. Well, there he goes. Received. Whoop. Go get it. Come back. Come back. Give me the ball. Oh, okay. I was hoping to do curry before we did uncamped, but okay. That's fine. I was mostly doing it for him. Okay, so. Well, no, that's a P dove. Uh, no, uh, fine. I uh, gotta get you out of the way, I guess. P dove. Run. Okay. It was around here. Oh, yep. Yeah, there's one. Hey. Butterfree. No! Oh. Is it just going to run away entirely? Yeah. Huh. Is there, like, a way to attract them? Hey, Butterfree. Maybe I gotta sneak up? Ooh. Sneaking. Nope! Nope! Ah, oh, yeah, they flew away. Come on, give me one! Oh. Uh, uh, uh. Friend. No! Ah. Is there, like... Hold on, let me see if I have, like, an item that can help or something. Um... Those are all the balls. That's not probably gonna help much. Uh, I don't know how I'd even use a berry for that. No, uh, so, no, not repel. The opposite. Attract. Do I have an attract move? Oh, I should also probably use this on a spore, since I'm gonna be using it quite a bit. Um. Hmm. None of the TMs are gonna help. Honey? Will honey do? No, that's just a selling thing. No, this is all... All that. Anything. Nope. Whistling and then let it come to me. Uh, yeah, I'll give that a shot. Maybe it is the running... I mean, uh, like, insects. You know, you gotta, like, sneak up on them in the real world. You come to me. Oh, oh, okay. It was interesting for a second, and then it kind of just dipped. Hmm. Nope, now that's a P-Dove. Get out of here. Get out of here. Whoa. Ugh. Nope, run. Hmm, I I think I'm going to take a quick break, and uh, I'm going to try Googling to see if there's, like, something I could do to fix it, but I will be RB, so do not touch the internet dial. Don't go anywhere, folks. Be right back. Also, I'm going to reset the Elgato again real quick, so don't... That's not everything shutting down, just I'm 
I'm just a, a quick reset. Sorry. Hey, I'm back. Uh, yeah, I don't know. It looks like there's specific abilities that can, like, attract certain Pokemon, but I didn't find anything for Bug. Let's do this. I don't... I think I'm probably gonna, um... Probably gonna finish up the stream after I get this Butterfree, and I'm gonna, I'm gonna try and get into a raid battle, but... If not, I'll probably do one next time, for sure. Alright, um... Let me save just to be safe all right let's see if I can work out some way to get this hmm oh, ah, no no get Pidove, get out of here get out of here taking up my time
Run, run, run. Uh, wait, hold on, I can... There we go. So now if I do this... There we go. There's, a uh, yeah, programmable buttons on the bottom of this, so I just made A the left one, so if I'm drinking water or whatever, I can still go through the action commands. No, another... Get out of here! Okay, come on. Come on, where's... I just... No! No, no, no! Get out of here! I want the butter for you. I just want a butter for you, dude. Just one. Uh, whoops. Come on. Nope, nope, another dove. Come on down here, I gotta get you. Maybe I should actually, like, um, faint the dove. See if that gives me a better rate for the Butterfree. Nope. I checked the chat and my mind like got wiped. I totally forgot what I was, my plan was. Oh gosh, it's like uh, what is it? I remember reading somewhere that it's like it's a similar thing to when you walk through a doorway, any kind of doorway, whether uh, there's a door or not. Um, the human brain is like programmed to like wipe short-term memory when you do that. So if you find yourself like wandering from room to room trying to like and you like forget something. That's probably why. So it's good to stay in a specific room until you can write it down. That being said, I still forget to, often. And look at that. Literally once again, I forgot. Ah, hold on, I'm gonna try another spot. I just need, I just need one Butterfree, man. I just need one. Oh, mud break. Hmm. No, oh, that's a bundle bee. I keep thinking this is a butterfree noise. Oh, butterfree. Come here. Come here, little buddy. Down, get down low. Oh, oh, almost, almost, a little lower. No, ah, nope, too late. It's out. And now there's a dove again. Hold on, I'm gonna run away and then come back. Hmm. No, not the... I'm trying to turn the bike off and I keep hitting the bell. Turn the bike off. What am I even talking about? Nope. Growlithe, no. Growlithe, no. Not right now. Oh. Oh. So close. Please. Please get lower. Please get just low enough. I just need to bump into you just once. Quiet. No! Ah, uh, frick. Okay. 
can I like throw out a snack or something? Like in the uh the the safari zone? I just don't know I just don't know what to do. Oh cool, camp. Um Let me get in here. Hey Jimmy. What's happening? Toy. Shinotic. Shinotic, my child. Come. Yeah, well, I have a Metapod, so I think... I'm gonna try... Hmm... I'm gonna try five more times. If I lose five more Butterfreeze, then I'm just gonna commit to just leveling up a Metapod. But I will do, I'll probably do that next time, I think. Come on, buddy. One more, one more. All right, cooking. I want to cook. Yeah, let's cook. Okay, yeah, I think the one I have is like level 7. Check ingredients. Let's see. I got some good stuff. Though carelessly picked, these herbs can add a fragrant accent. Huh. Uh... All right. Oh yeah, my curry decks. I gotta finish this out at some point too. Oh my god. Oh wow, there's a lot of curries. <laughs> but I mean, if I said full decks, then I'll do the full decks. I do like the, the curry cooking. Come on, dude. Come on. You want to make some curry? You want want to make? Ah, oh, he packed up. Well, that's fine. Some other time. All right. Ooh, wait a minute. Raid battle. Okay, let's give it a shot. Join in. Let's see if it'll work this time. Yes, I'm in. Ice. Wait, switch Pokemon. I'm going to switch to Fluffston. Ready to battle. Ho. Is what Is Ho O oh, fire type? I don't actually know. I never got one. I was more focused on the legendary dogs in that particular one. Hmm. Is there supposed to be music here? Let me... Fire flying. Okay. Yeah, and that me Lugia is, uh... Water flying then, huh? Uh... Hold on, let me see if I can... No, wait, no. There's still sound effects, so I guess there's just not music in this screen. Well, let's... I guess we're waiting to see what happens with that, so... I uh... guess it's time for more of this. Do -do -do -do. Whoa. Oh, come on. Ugh, I'm sort of... I haven't, like, done anything in, like, a week as far as this stuff goes. Uh, yeah, yeah. Psychic flying. Okay. Interesting. Let's do this. Whoa, what is that on the left? With the big old ring on its head. I guess I'll find out. My cable's a little, uh... Hucked up with some stuff. Uh, I mean, flamethrower. 
That's that's super effective. Let's do it. Whoa. That's pretty sick. I really love all the unique um, Dynamaxes. Whoa. Get him. Okay, that was a pretty, pretty solid hit. Ah, no! The barrier! That's fine, we'll take it out. Flamethrower! Hmm. That sucks that that critical got wasted on the barrier, but alright. Oh, jeez. No! My boy! Well, shoot. That's unfortunate. I would have helped out more, but oh well. Body slab. Uh, cheer on. That's pretty much all I can do. Alright, let's see. Let's see what they can do. Nice. Well, that took out the barrier at least. Overheat. Alright, gum down into the yellow. That's good, that's good. No! Ah, not another barrier. Okay. Oh boy, who are you taking out this time? The Salazzle! Can we appreciate how different the Salazzle sprite is from the Salazzle model? The Salazzle model is just like all, ooh. Look at, I'm a slinky serpent, and... I mean, I'm not gonna say that it's over-sexualized, but I mean... Listen, they know what they made with that model. Uh... But like the the little sprite is just like, eh, I'm a lizard. I'm coming at you. Very uh incredibly varying concepts here. Communicating. Come on. Come on, let's do it. Take out the barrier. Oh dang, two! Okay. That's good, we can get it all in one turn. What is that? What is that thing with the, the the two hands in a ring up top? I've not seen that before. Oof. Stop. No, thank you. Okay. Oh, you gonna Dynamax? Nope. Oh no, it's Salazzle's coming back. Oh, a mythical Pokemon, okay, that's why. Volcanian, interesting. Hit him. Ooh, we're very close. I think this is our last, last opportunity. Almost. Yes. Yes. We did it. Throw a Pokeball. Catch. Uh. Ultra Ball. Ultra Ball. Come on. Come on, do we got it? Whoa, oh geez. I'll bet the controller would be rumbling like crazy. 
Oh my god, I completely fumbled that line. It would be rumbling like crazy. Oh, nice! Nice, I got it, okay. Um, but this doesn't have rumble. That's one of the big things. It's wired, doesn't have drift, but it's like it doesn't have rumble or uh, motion controls. Nice, got it. Okay, and we got Dynamax candies, experience candies. Nice, wow, wow, we got a, the three TMs, holy crap. You get a lot from these, okay. Avalug, the iceberg Pokemon. As Avalug moves about during the day, the cracks in its body deepen. The Pokemon's body returns to a pristine state overnight. Yeah, we're gonna go with uh, flat top. Real simple, flat top. All right. Pretty pleased with that. Okay, I got four more tries on Butterfree here before I call it a night. So let's let's do. F Wait, woo. Did you, did you just peer? Okay. Nope, nothing. Is this even the spot? No, there. Okay, that's the spot. Up, you dove. Get out of here. Get out of here. gonna just gonna moon blast it into oblivion ah <sighs> kind of feels bad honestly all right butter free huh oh, right on top of me okay just gotta slow it's not low enough. Lower, you need to go lower. Butterfree. Do I just gotta treat it like an actual butterfly and wait for it to land? Come on, come on. A little lower, a little lower. Oh, huh? no, not quite. Nope, ah, oh, dang it. Well, I knew moving would have been bad. Okay, so that's two. Three more tries. Oh. Come on. Nope. Dang it. Two more. Two more. Two more, and then I'm just going to have to evolve a Metapod. I might honestly just have a stone for that. But. Dang it. Ah, uh, one more, one more. Come on, come on. It's just, it's gonna be so much more satisfying if I actually catch it. Get over here. Get down here. Get down here. I got one more shot. One more opportunity. Will I capture it? Or will it just friggin' sweat and fly away again? Let's find out. Yep. Mm hmm. Okay, come on, come on. Gonna keep an eye out in case it spawns. I don't wanna. No, okay, that's a P dove. See, they come right to me. But Butterfree, Butterfree runs. Run, run, run. It's not even worth it. It's not even worth it. Yeah. All this work. Okay. Take it real slow. K 
case they pop up. I don't wanna I don't wanna scare it away. Let's go we're gonna go into uh wildlife commentary mode here. Gotta I've got to be able to find the butterfree and find find a way to catch it without scaring it off. It's a very temperamental Pokemon. And it's very, very difficult to keep it from running away, so we were we were very lucky for our cameras to capture capture this particular creature. Where? Whoop, nope, nope, that's a P dove. Mm, come on. Often, the Butterfree is ousted from its territory by the much more dominant p -Dub. Their numbers must be culled a great deal before there's even the ability... Oh, Mr. Burns evolved. Good, good. Their numbers must be culled greatly before... Before we... Uh... Before we can find the creature which we are looking for. No. Uh, no, no, get a Growlithe. Come on. It's been 30 years since the last Butterfree was caught in this area. It's going to be a very difficult, difficult thing to do. So we want to make sure that we have every opportunity to do so. So, prepare yourself. This this should be quite exciting. Don't be distracted by the sounds of the Growlithe and the Mudbray playing in the... Ah! Ah! Well, that was my last shot. Hold, uh, to hold on, come on. That, w that one sucked. No, nope, it's a P-Dub. Okay. Ah, dang it. Well, I got some. I got something. Let's see what... How many did I get? I started with 129. So I got eight Pokemon. I got eight Pokemon this run. So that's still, that's still pretty decent. That being said, did not get the Butterfree. Um, let me see if I have... Bugstone? Would it be? Shiny stone. I don't know. I don't think that would work for him. Rushing peach, never melt scar, clever feather. Leaf stone? No, that's only graph, grass type, I think. Or is it? I don't know. It only evolves by level up. Okay, that's fine. Um, Let me just see what... Uh, Right, I gotta go to the bag. And I gotta grab the Pokemon box link. Uh, huh? Pokemon boxes. Um. Swap. No. Oh, there it is, R to boxes. Okay, I got it. Let's see, where is my Metapod? Oh no, I put my Metapod out to work, so I won't find out until next time. Well, that's a bit of a disappointing place to end the stream, but you know what? I still did okay, I got eight. So that's that's a solid chunk. Um, I am gonna need to get 50 times that to finish everything up, so. It's going to be a bit. Yeah, thanks. Hey, you're very welcome for the stream, Sean. And thank you very much for joining me on the stream. And thanks to everybody else, whether you watched in the uh, past, the present, or the future. If you want to catch the beginning of this stream because you came in later or for whatever reason, you can check the past broadcast tab up above, which has the last 60 days worth of streams. You can check out Iggy Kid Twitch Archive, which is linked down below. It's a YouTube channel that has all of my past streams since I started out. 
Uh, you can also find Iggy and the Ape, which is my personal YouTube where I post movie reviews, board game unboxings, uh, video essays, all sorts of different stuff. Um, I got something coming up next weekend that's going to be really fun, but I'll talk more about that when it goes up live. If you want to catch any future streams, be sure to check uh, the schedule down below, which says what game on what day. Or you can click the icon there with the lion and go to the schedule tab on the main page of the stream, and that will show you what hour and what game on what day, but that's all subject to change. So if you want to make sure you don't miss a stream, follow me on Twitter at IggyDKid and turn notifications on. I tweet out every time I go live, about a half hour before, but you know I'll, I'll put the time in the tweet most times. Um, the best way to make sure you don't miss a stream is to follow me if you click the heart somewhere around here. I don't know, but if you click the heart, it is free for you. All you need is a free Twitch account, and it greatly benefits the stream. I'm only five away from affiliate, so if you could be one of those five, I'd really appreciate it. And at any time, I'd really appreciate it if you consider uh, following the stream. I put a lot of work into it, and you can turn on notifications with the Twitch app or through email, I believe, to make sure you don't miss any of my streams. Once again, uh, excuse me, need a little bit of water. Once again, I'd like to thank you for inviting me into your home, whether it was on your computer, your tablet, your phone, your laptop, your uh, gaming device, your Roku TV, your Apple TV, however it is you watch tonight. I hope I brought some entertainment and levity into your life. I hope you'll join me on Friday for maybe eShop demos, maybe something else. That's always the kind of toss-up day, but, you know, just check the schedule and stuff. But I'll hope, I hope you'll join me. And, hey, if nobody else has said this, I'll say this right now. You're a good kid. Thanks for watching, everybody. Goodbye. Good night. Join me on Friday, 8 p.m. Eastern. Follow me. All those things. Thank you. Goodbye. Good night. Oh, um, and actually, I, I will probably read y'all over to uh, somebody else who's live right now to kind of share the love. So uh, don't go away. Let's see who's who's live. Uh, Pink Room Gaming is playing Animal Crossing? Yeah, sure. So that's Pink Room Gaming. Sure. Sure, sure, sure. So I'll raid y'all over to their slash. Raid Pink Room Gaming. Make sure autocorrect doesn't mess that up. Do, 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 do. Raid, raid, raid. There we go. Good night, everybody.